Taiwanese tech giant TSMC warns an invasion of the island would render its factory inoperable, devastating global supply. Tensions are rising ahead of a potential visit to Taiwan by US House Speaker Nancy Pelosi. And the growing chip shortage continues. Last week, Taiwan said its key position in making semiconductors won't be shaken in response to the US passing a law to subsidize its domestic semiconductor industry in an effort, it says, to compete globally. Europe wants to ramp up production. Germany's been trying to clinch a deal for a plant from TSMC, the biggest player. The company's factories in Taiwan are running at full capacity to alleviate the shortages. Over to our studio in Taipei, where Zach Lee is standing by. Here in Germany uh, and in Europe, some politicians are warning of a lack of semiconductors due to the tensions in Taiwan. Do people in Taipei have the same concerns? Well, as you mentioned, people here do have concerns about a shortage of chips. But this is not because of the tensions in the region. For sure, an attack by China will cut off essential technological goods and human capital. But this is obviously not something most of people here are concerned about. Local people here are very used to China's threat, all the tensions between China and Taiwan, all the tensions between the U.S. and China. In fact, what is being discussed more is the Chips and Science Act passed in the U.S. last week. That act is a plan to increase the amount of microchips in the U.S. That has made Taiwan worried about its key position in making semiconductors. As we all know, Taiwan plays an important role in global supply of semiconductors. It dominates the world's production of semiconductors. Uh, to respond uh, to the CHIPS Act in the U.S., the Taiwanese authorities also try to show their confidence in its semiconductor uh, production. Yes, made a statement regarding the CHIPS Act in the U.S., saying that it could help Taiwanese chip makers by providing them subsidies to build their manufacturing facility in the U.S. Um, Zach, can I just ask you how you see this story developing, considering the importance of the local semiconductor industry to the world um, and, and all these different changes and challenges that are facing the industry right now? Yeah, as I mentioned, Taiwan has TSMC, which is the largest chip maker in Asia. It makes more than half of the chips in the world. In our daily life, many of our high-tech products have high-quality chips inside. For instance, you have an iPhone in your pocket and also a laptop for desktop. Those all need chips inside, and chips are so essential component uh, of electronic devices. It's like it's like the brand of electronics, enabling technologies critical to global economic growth, as well as national security and the country's global competitiveness. And this is why Taiwan's manufacturer industry is very important for the world. OK, it's going to be very interesting to see how this one plays out. Lots of companies and countries involved, and uh, the competition is going to remain fierce, I'm sure. Zach Lee for us there in Taipei. Thank you. Thank you.